Hi, everyone, along with Eddie Olchek, and you'll hear and see Ray Ferraro in just a moment. And I'm Mike Emmerich, and we are tonight seeing a team that is on a bit of a downside. They have not been able to win consistently lately. Take us inside that locker room. What's it like? Well, you got to try to find some confidence, Doc, right now, because you are shaken. The pressure is on you. Your fans are on you. The media is on you. Your coach is probably all over you. But I think more than anything else, it's a mindset. Is Let's not really try to worry about winning the game because that is the end result, and we know that. But let's win the first period and see where we are after the first period of play. The Oilers find themselves on a losing streak as of late, but they have been doing some good things. It's just a matter of time before they are rewarded for all their hard work. Maybe it's tonight. Let's look at the starting netminders. Corey Schneider gets the start developed with the U.S. national team, then Boston College, then the American Hockey League, then Vancouver, then with the legend Marty Brodeur. He's learned his trade well. Talbot's the man at the other end of the ice for the Oilers. Hall's out there for the start. They know he can establish their style early. Edmonton's got the puck, and they get to make the first play. That pass tipped away by the opposition. Chip to Lucic. Let's it go. No! He had enough room there to get that in the short side. However, he misses the net. It doesn't matter how fast it is. If you don't get it in the 4 by 6 it's not going to go in. Let's it go. Great glove grab. He does his best to get out of the way, but he can't get out of the way now. We're throwing it down to Ray Ferraro. Schneider's play this season has been so consistent. He's got an excellent win-loss record. He doesn't give up the bad goal when it's a crippling time for a team. He makes the big save when he has to. And as a result, the penalty killing's been really good, and they have enough confidence to be aggressive offensively to put enough numbers up on the board. Hung right over him and couldn't get it passed. You want to score goals, you have to go to this area. You got to find a way to put it in the net. Terrific left save, but it's loose. A good, solid shot, but a strong stop and deflection out of play off the goaltender. The Devils have looked like a perfect hockey team over the last 10 games. Whether it's their special teams, their five-on-five -five play, their goaltending, they've had the answer to any question any opponent has put to them. They want to play as aggressively as they can tonight, Doc, because their opponents have really struggled. Breakaway! Marvelous save. Didn't buy what he was selling. Looking to Hall. New Jersey's carrying on at center ice. Wonderful block. And now it's directed to Lucic. Gains the blue line. Gives it to the point. Fires! Oh, a save. Oh, well, the goalie was screened on that shot. You got to rely on your positioning to make that save. Under seven minutes have been played. Only a pair of goals so far equally divided. The Oilers prevail again. Poke checked away by Green. It's a good pickup. Goaltender pass. Brought ahead. Puck loose. Couldn't get through. From the outside. Oh, and it's off the mark. That's going to happen. There's not a lot of room there. He just missed the shot. Hatchets one. Oh, and the pass wouldn't go. To the point it comes. Lightning like reflexes there. Great glove save. Edmonton's been stuck offensively for quite some time now. One of the reasons is he has not been able to put anything on the board. Usually when a player of his ilk hasn't scored a goal, he's been able to create something with a pass. Nothing has happened for him. He hasn't had a point in a long time. The Oilers with a face-off win. Edmonton's in control as they travel up the wing. With a shot, blocked. Nice work by Mason. Slid to Maroon. On to Lucic. Got that in the trapper. Oh, he thought he had him on the glove side. At the front of the net. Snaps it to Lucic. 
Trying to go to Hall. Gains the zone and looks over his options. Good place to shoot from. Right to the point. Let's it go. Oh, what a back shot came from nowhere. Seems like he was in too tight on the goaltender. Shoot, got that. Tremendous scoring chance. to the point and at an angle to Russell off a body snapped off a wrist shot and this period is over wow are you ready for a walk down memory lane then it's time to sign up for our fantasy camp play hockey with childhood heroes it's a fun filled week full of memories